Okay, decided not to get those shirts, even though they're five bucks and they're really nice, but because I have shirts, I mean, they're more visible. Yeah, great, but I'm, I'm broke. So I literally have three shirts in my hand. I put them back. I'm like, I already have, I think, two or three of the visible shirts. So I'll get them eventually, but you know. Um, I got my girlfriend uh, Frosted Flakes, and it's, look, it's the mega size, so it's the huge box they make. And then I wanted to try these ones anyway, because they're better for you, the Kashi brand. The cement toast are, whatever, the weeds are good, but like, it all washes off in like three seconds, and there's not much on there. But if these are better for you, and they're organic, and there's 52 grams of whole grain, if these are healthy for you, I'll get these. So, got that, and then... Only one thing I really bought, and it's basically for camping, is these things are cool. Um, it looks well made. Um, I see the reviews are good and bad, but this is a great brand. And it's either get it now, or they won't have it, or get some other brand on Amazon, or do all that crap. Like, no, I'll just get it while I'm here. Basically, you stick it on those green propane things. You can adjust the knob, how much flame you want. That way, it's easier to light a fire pit or wherever you want to light. It's easy to do. Just screw it on the green propane things. And those things are like two for ten bucks, and I have like four in my garage, so this is nice. I have a uh, flame, like fire pit starter things, you know, that are easier to. But this in general will just light the fire pit like easily. And I also have matches, but it's I kind of keep those in my first aid kit just to need it for some reason. But this is coming handy. It looks pretty well made. Everything is uh, durable stainless steel. Um, trigger start ignition, obviously. Adjustable flame knob. Um, so I don't know. Has a three year warranty on it, and it's made in Columbus, Ohio. So, because every time we go camping, we trouble starting the fire because it's a pain. You guys, there, hope your matches work, or I use those like dollar store lighters because they're they're cheap. They're like a dollar. I mean, it would cost you more to refuel those things than buy new ones, but they're crap. You get this little tiny flame, and I always bring them with me camping, but they're pain. So this one, I'm just going to screw on the damn propane thing and be done with it. So the fire goes out, we light it again. So that's my water adventure today. And now I'm going to go home and eat and have a Red Bull or something because I'm hungry and it's literally almost three o'clock. It's, it's 2.40 right now. So got my taxes done. I don't, don't owe anything. I had to pay for the service, but that's basically what I made back in taxes. And, uh, they're not doing the whatever the, the state tax thing, so that's cool. And then unemployment, there was a little box you check to take out for taxes, and I did that. So I didn't know about that first, but <laughs> after a while, I noticed it. So, and what's nice about the unemployment money is that it's it's not taxable up until fourteen thousand above that. Then it's taxable, but I don't owe any money back. That's good. I just had to pay for the tax service. Um, I'm not getting anything back basically because what I'm getting back is what it costs to do my taxes. So. I'm zeroed out, but I don't know anything, so that's always a good sign. So I'm going to go home and probably eat, re-eat the rest of my pasta, although it's quite hot. I don't know if I want that. So either way, I think I'm going to drink Red Bull, and I'm signing off from Bank of America slash Walmart.